15 for Niang, seven here in the fourth quarter. He's put Cleveland ahead by four with a minute 30 to play. Rozier, a step back three, he got fouled and he scored. Just what Miami needed. Sudden impact on a Rozier three plus a foul. Big time step back. How about the focus and concentration here to convert this shot and take the contact. Wow. Terry Rozier, shot maker, 18 points on 7 of 15, including 4 of 5 from 3. None bigger than that one. Looks like Cleveland will be challenging this foul call. We have a coach's challenge by Cleveland for the defense foul. Because if you're not giving Rozier the space to come down, well, it, it could review, be a we have an unsuccessful challenge. We have a normal drift of the leg by the shooter, and the distance covered by the defender is a defensive foul. We have one free throw, and we will play off that. With no, you know, Tyler Hero out there, you do have Jimmy Butler, but you need people to be able to create their own shot. And Terry Rozier has that ability because he's really good as a ball handler, and he can spread the floor as a three-point shot maker. Well, this could tie it at 100. A four-point play for Rozier, and it's a new game. Almost a steal. Minute 18 to play. He put the pressure on. Rozier hustling back to Okoro. Now switches out to Levert. Six on the shot clock. Levert attacks. And the shot clock expires. What a chess match, and the Heat win that sequence with some excellent defense. The turnover for Cleveland gets it back to Miami in a game that is now tied at 100. That is a big-time defensive possession. That is Miami Heat defense right there to go the length of the clock and prevent them from even getting a shot attempt. Full house in Cleveland. I hope you're enjoying this one in your house, folks. 48 seconds left in a tied game. Jimmy to his right, turns back, ducks in, now fires, and scores! With two seconds left on the shot clock, Butler puts the Heat up 102 to 100. Six straight points for the Heat. 35 seconds left. Garland in the Allen. Oh, he got free for a right-hand jam. So we are now tied at 102. Garland finding Allen. That was a ninth assist for Garland. You'd have two timeouts. Cleveland with one. Got a nine-second differential. Seven, eight-second differential, excuse me. Rozier to his right. Now back to the left against Sakura. Terry step back three. Got it! Terry Rozier trying to take the game over. A four-point play followed by that huge triple. A nine-point fourth quarter eruption for Terry Rozier is giving the Heat a three-point lead with 14 and a half seconds left. Oh, my, a homecoming of sorts for the youngster native able to knock down another step-back three. Look at this one. Oh, my, little footwork bouncing to his right. Nothing but cord. That is big-time shot-making. And Terry Rozier now with 22 points. Oh, my. Oh, bo born in, in Young Shen, went to high school in nearby Shaker Heights, Ohio. Look, if they can build on what they did on the last possession, holding Cleveland down and to not even get the shot off, you got to believe they're going to come out and get the ball into Garland, uh, Darius Garland's hands and let him go to work. He'd have to do a better job on this pick and roll. They got Haywood Highsmith in the game now, guard Jared Allen. He and Jimmy Butler will probably try to switch on some of these pick and rolls, but they cannot allow Allen to get something going to the rim easy here either. Everybody in the best seats in the lower bowl on their feet. Final 11 seconds of the game. Levert guarded by Butler, drives baseline, circles out. It's Niang with four seconds left, lays it in. With under four seconds left, it's a one-point game at 105 to 104. The Heat seem willing to give up a, th a two, but, but not a three. And now they put Cleveland in position that the Cavaliers are going to have to go for a steal and then a very quick foul.
He'd still have one timeout if they need it. If they can't inbound the ball, Cleveland at a timeout. So even if they're able to get the basketball, they're not going to be able to advance it into the front court with a timeout. They're going to have to play it live. He's stretching out the defense here using all 94 feet. Want to get it to somebody you can trust to make free throws. They get it to Rozier, and they fool Cleveland defensively. They really fooled the Cavaliers by putting two players uh, in, in the backcourt. They spread it out. John, it was an easy catch for Rozier. And, and then the late foul with 2.8 seconds left. So Rozier will go to the line for two shots. Rozier is one for one at the free throw strike tonight. 86% for the season. With a heat ahead by one. That was a big one right there. This is this is the most important one here to make sure you at least have a three-point lead and take away any open shots. You can't foul here. You don't want to overextend and foul a half-court type shot and give Cleveland an opportunity for three free throws. For a three-point lead. Rozier now has nine points in the last minute and a half of this game. Good timeout. They got to go the length of the floor. 107, 104, Miami. You do not foul if you're the Heat here. Nia looking deep. Got Allen. Gives to Garland. Gets it off. Missed it. And Miami holds on and wins the game. A meaningful March win on the road for the Heat. On what they hope is the road to the NBA playoffs. The Heat hold on and win it 107 to 104. Miami improves its record to 38 and 31.